I'm Sarah Cantalow and I'm going to be hanging an ivy piggyback uh, for Nurse 130 Fall 2018. Um, so the medication I'm choosing to administer today is going to be the Cefazolin 2000 milligrams um, in 100 ml of solution at running at 100 ml per hour. Um, so what I would have brought into, into the room with me is the medication which is the Cefazolin and then I'll have the secondary IV tubing and that's going to come along um, with this hanger and some alcohol prep pads. So um, what I would have done uh, before coming into the room with the medication is do my two checks and then coming to the patient's bedside I'll do my third check. I would come into the room and check two patient identifiers and that could be um, the name and date of birth or the MRN um, and then I would check to make sure that the patient is not allergic to the medication um, or if he had any allergies to medication that I'm not aware of. And I would also check to make sure, or I would have checked that the medication being administered is compatible with um, whatever primary uh, fluid is running. And cefazolin is compatible with normal saline, so I know that it is safe to administer. Um, so what I would do first is I would get my secondary tubing and um, this is a sterile uh, procedure, so I wouldn't want to touch um, the cap of this to any other, um, I wouldn't want to touch the end of this to anything, and I would want to put it directly into my secondary bag. So I would spike the bag, and I would make sure that the IV line is clamped. Now I'll just hang this here since I don't need this right now. And then I'll go ahead and hang my primary bag lower than the secondary bag. Okay. So I'll go ahead and put on some gloves. So what I want to do is I want to prime this line and I can either do it by back priming or I can make sure um, that if I prime the line originally that I'm not wasting any of the medication when I uh, start to prime the line. So I'll go ahead and I'll unlock the tubing. Okay. And then I'll go ahead and clamp it once I reach um, the very end of the tubing. And once I have that, I'll get my alcohol prep pad. And then I'll clean the Y site. I'll clean the hub for 15 seconds or per hospital protocol. And then I'll attach the secondary tubing. Okay, once I've attached the secondary tubing, I can pause the primary line and then I'll go ahead and channel select that same channel and I'll choose secondary and then I'll search for my medication and that's gonna be the cefazolin and I'll choose the two grams or 2000 milligrams in 100 ml per solution and I just wanna make sure that I double check the bag and that is actually correct, two grams in 100 ml and then I, and then I can confirm yes and then I'll press next to confirm, and then I'll press start once I've confirmed it one more time. Volume to be infused, 100 ml. Okay, and I have to make sure that I unclamp the tubing, and then I won't leave until I see that the first drop has been dropped. And we're all set.